Welcome on in, everybody. My name is Bree, and I want to welcome you to this 20-minute box and sculpt workout today. So we're going to be going between boxing, some kicking combos as well, and then I will be using my 552 Select Tech dumbbells for some sculpting sections as well. So if you're coming in live, welcome. And if it's your first time, welcome on in. We're going to go ahead and warm up as I do in all of my workouts. So this is a complete workout, start to finish. We will finish with a little bit of a stretch at the end as well. So go ahead and find some space. Take a big deep breath in through the nose. And exhale. Put that big smile on right away. Give me two more deep breaths in. Exhale. Last big breath, and we're going to be ready to go. Inhale. And exhale. And then I want you to go ahead and just find your boxer shuffle. So on the toes, we are going to warm up in a more cardiovascular way today because we'll get into our first boxing com combos. Hi, Joseph. <laughs> hey, get your guards up, you know? <laughs> All right, let's learn some of the punches. So with your front arm, I want you to just show me a jab. So we're going to go knuckles on top. Now, always remember you're boxing the same target. So whether you're doing a jab or a cross, you're going to be hitting the same target. So I want you to extend your arm about 90%. Don't lock out your elbow, but put a lot of power behind that punch. And now we're going to take that back arm, and that's going to be your cross. So go ahead and turn your body. Now the biggest thing you want to think about when you're using that back arm, whether you're crossing or uppercuts, is that you're really using a lot of force through your lower body and rotation through the core to get a lot of power. We're going to go ahead and put those together. So one jab, one cross. And now you start to feel that power in the punch behind you. Yes? Keep going. We're going to go into a front arm hook next. Good, big smiles on you guys, big energy. All right, with that front arm, go ahead and bring it across. And we're going to rotate, watch that front heel. You release your front heel, and there's your hook in front. Very nice job. Hi, A. Logan. Good morning, good to see you. All right, with your back arm, go ahead and drive up. And here's an uppercut. So you want to get down, really underneath it, and drive up with that inverted fist. And just like we did with our jab cross, let's put those two together, hook and uppercut. Now the combos are gonna be pretty basic in nature today. You're gonna make it intense by putting a lot of power in your punch. Hi Brenda, good to see you. And really punching with a lot of force. All right, bob and weave side to side. Take your guard up right in front, and we're gonna switch to the other lead. Same thing, let's just go through those four punches. Good. Okay, boxer shuffle on the toes. So you're gonna see me switch from one side to the next, and we'll repeat the combos. All right, so on the toes with that front arm now, show me that jab. <sighs> Lean into it. Hi, Dixie. Oh, good. <laughs> Coffee first, I hear ya. <laughs> well, you'll be ready to go. All right, front arm. Again, 90% extension, straight out from that shoulder, and lean into it. You gotta lean in towards that target. All right, with your back arm now, give me that cross, and you're gonna pivot. Remember, rotation. You wanna really tighten up the core, and see my back heel? You lift the heel and drive across. Great job, you guys. All right, let's put those together. One jab, one cross. Really getting your body warm. Good. All right, you start to feel that energy pick, in, pick up, right? It's starting to kick in. <sighs> okay, with that front arm, we're going to take it to a hook, driving across the body. And again, 90 degrees with that arm. And it's not a huge wind-up. It's tight, and you get a lot of rotation in the hips. And there's your power. Nice job. Okay, back arm uppercut. <sighs> And I want you to bend your knees. You're getting down and up. Very nice. Whew. Just a couple more. We're going to put those together. One hook, one up. Let's go. Hook up. Whew. I know you guys are ready to go now. We're going to get into our first combo. We'll go back to that first lead side. Whew. Good. Just give me a couple more seconds here. Whew. Three, two, one. Bob and weave. Okay, so let's go back to that first side. We're going to do a minute combo on each side, then we're going to grab our dumbbells and we're going to get into some bigger muscle groups and we're going to sculpt the body. So this is going to be a back and forth between cardio and strength. Grab a sip of water with me and keep it close 
because you want to be sipping on your breaks in between. All right, team, go ahead and find your boxer shuffle again on your first lead side, on the toes. We're going to do a very basic, watch me, jab, jab, up, up, then you're going to duck and hit that cross. That cross is your power punch. Are you ready? One minute on the clock with our first lead, then we will switch. Three, two, one, let's go. Jab, jab, up, up. You got to duck, use your legs, cross. Duck, cross, jab, jab, up, up, duck, cross. Good. As you get more into the combo, get more power. Make sure those punches look different. Jab, cross, up, up, duck, hit. Now you start to pull those abs in. Now you make your punches a little tighter. You're going to feel that you are going to start to burn through the shoulders, the biceps. Your abs are always on. 30 more seconds, please. Jab, jab, up, up. That uppercut, boom, right here, and boom, those are power punches. 15 more seconds. Jab, jab, up, up, duck, boom. Yes, ah, Joseph, I love it. Hit, jab, jab, up, up, duck, push, and break. Go ahead and boxer shuffle. You're going to stay on your toes because you got to be ready. And we're going to go to that other side. So second lead side, another minute on the clock. Then we're going to do some major muscle group strength moves coming up next. All right, team, ready? Hit it. Jab, jab, up, up, duck, boom, <laughs> duck, hit, jab, jab, up, up. They don't see you coming. <laughs> you come up with that cross. Jab, jab, up, up, duck, hit. <laughs> Good, you gotta keep everything nice and tight. Really use your core, a lot of power. Jab, jab, up, up, duck, cross. Hit it, come on guys, 30 more seconds. I got one question for you. When you're here, when you're in the workout, keep going, it is time to push. 20 minutes is over before you know it, don't let it pass you by. Come on, 15 more seconds. The combos, again, are basic in nature, so you can really work on power and worry less about complicated combos. Jab, up, duck, boom. Come on, last one, time. Okay, woo, I want you to go ahead and grab a medium size of your dumbbells. Watch me, we're gonna go into a travel curl press. So our strength movements are gonna be multi-muscular, <laughs> Full body, high and low, and we really want to push it on this set. So go ahead and grab your medium weight. And the reason that I don't always cue exactly what resistance I want you to have is because it's very individual. Okay, 15 seconds, we're going to go. Travel squat to our shoulder press. Are you ready? Yes or absolutely yes. <laughs> Three, two... One, let's hit it. So we travel our squat, we curl, and we press on top. Good, keep going. Down, abs in tight. Now notice I have a neutral grip with my shoulder press. You can absolutely open up and get a little bit wider range of motion. It's totally up to you. Good. The pace should feel like it definitely slowed, and now, we're sculpting the upper body as we press overhead and getting low into that squat for our lower body as we travel it. Great job. I'm showing you two different grips, positions with your hands, and you choose what works best for you. It's really gonna be dependent upon your shoulder mobility. Travel and press overhead. Nice job, team. We're holding these strength circuits 90 seconds. Longer, right? We do a lot of Tabata in our Tuesday, Thursday sessions. It's a longer section today, both with our cardio and with our strength portions. But change is good. Change is necessary. Good, you're almost there. You got 10 more seconds. Let's see. Press it up. Very nice job. Down. Arms up, push it up, and 
take a breather. Okay, shake it out. Our next move, I'm gonna have you in a flex position. We're gonna reverse lunge, come down, lateral raise, bring it back up. So similar muscle groups as our first set. Little biceps, little shoulders, legs, booty, 10 seconds, 90 seconds in this strength move. Are you guys ready? All right. The flex position on our lunge makes it a little bit more challenging, so do your best. Here we go. Reverse lunge. Come down from that. It's a reverse bicep curl. Lateral raise. Come up. Alternate your legs. Down. Up. Lateral raise. Nice work. Oh, man. When you need a quick cardio and sculpt workout, this is your jam, you guys. The heart rate's up. Hello, hello. I am so thankful for your love. Thank you. De is it Sharon? Let me know how to pronounce your name. Or Sharon. But thank you for the love. I'm so glad you enjoy them. And that's the beauty of it. You can come back and do them anytime. All right, you guys. We're almost there. Keep going. Reverse lunge. Hold your balance. Excuse me. Hold your core tight. And then out to the side. All your arms. Definitely starting to feel that burn, right? Out to the side. We're almost there. I just need a few more. And then just when, keep going, just when your strength, you don't have any more left, we're going to burn it out a little bit more with some boxing. Yes? You guys look really good. <sighs> Lateral raise. Come on. <sighs> All the way down. You got time for one or two more. Good. Last three, two, one, done. Okay, set your dumbbells down. You don't necessarily have to put them back in because we will be coming back, and you most likely want to use that same weight. All right, guys. We're going to do a little bit of a combo, including some legs. Are you ready? We're going to start in just about 10 seconds. Watch me. Jab, jab, cross. Then you're going to open up, and you're going to give me a roundhouse on the side. Roundhouse opens up the hip. Let's practice it. One minute on the clock. Here we go. Jab, jab, cross. Open your hip, slap. Jab, jab, cross. Open, slap. Good. <laughs> Open, slap. Hit, hit, boom. I always love that cross, right? Hit, hit, good night. Open and roundhouse. Keep going. I've slowed the pace a little bit. I'm going to pick it up right now, showing you once you have the movement. Hit, hit, cross. Open, slap. <laughs> Open your hips. Slap. Yes. So functional. I love the feeling of just getting that nice wide stance. Boom. There's all your power. Yes. Jab, jab, cross. Open. Slap. Come on. Ten more seconds, please. Jab, jab, cross. Open. Slap. Hit, hit, cross. Open. Slap. You're almost there. Hit, hit, cross. Open. Time. All right, shake it out. Shake out those arms. We're going to hit the second side. Then we're going to do another set of our strength moves. Same moves, so we get two sets in. Okay, guard up. One minute on the clock, please. Remember, jab, jab, cross. This time we open up. Slap other side. Here we go. <sighs> open. Slap. Jab, jab, cross. Open the hips. Slap. <sighs> open. Yes. Hit, hit, cross. Open. Slap, jab, jab, cross, open, love it, come on, hit, hit, cross, show me what you came with today, hit, hit, cross, Whew. you guys know, I really believe that exercise, keep going, I was just having a conversation about this yesterday as well, exercise can really bring out that superhero inside you, and notice I didn't say create, because you have it inside you, you just got to pull it out, and then you bring that superhero energy into your day, and that's where exercise becomes more than just the 20 minutes we spend together. It's a mindset. It's the energy and how you show up. Last one. Done. All right, you guys. Take a quick break, grab a sip of water, and we're going to go back to travel squat, curl press, reverse lunge, to lateral raise. 
All right. If you want to add a little bit more weight on, be my guest. I'm going to stick with the same resistance that I had for my first sets. This is set number two. Are you ready? And it's a big set, so take your time, go slow. The goal is that you hit a really deep range of motion, not that you just power through speed demon style. <laughs> you want to go real slow and controlled, getting nice and deep into that range of motion. All right, 90 seconds on the clock, please. And let's go. Travel, curl, press. Yes. Whew. Now, don't be surprised, because I know your heart rate is up. Don't be surprised if it continues to climb because we're using your entire body here. And if you have any aversion to pressing overhead, you can simply stay with that squat travel and just skip the press. You never want to push through movements that just don't feel right to your body. So always, always make sure that you're assessing what feels good to you and doing what is best for your body. Good pressing overhead. You guys, you can see with the clock, that we are almost done with your workout. So you never want to be in a position where you had more and you reserved it. Get it all out for me. Come on. Down, up, push. Beautiful work. You got 30 more seconds. I know, I know that you guys are pushing and it always matters the most in the very end. Come on, 20 more seconds. Keep going. Good. And I love those of you guys that popped in and just told me you're going to come do this later. That's fantastic because you're setting the intention, right? Down, up, push. Love it. Last three, two, one. Take a well-deserved break. Shake it out for me. Towel off and grab a sip. And we got one more reverse lunge to lateral raise. Then a little stretch. And I have to preface by saying, if you have more time, stretch more. These are the very, I give you the very bare minimum for stretching, so we have a lot of time for the cardio and strength portion. Okay, 90 seconds on the clock. And if you're looking for some stretch, I got a lot of 10 minute options for you in our library. Okay, here we go. Reverse lunge, lateral raise. Good. <sighs> Take your time. There is no need to rush this set. The thing I want you to really think about is your form. I also want you to think about your range of motion. So going as deep as you can in your lunge, really feeling it through the glutes, pushing up, and purposely slowing it down. Just to give you a little bit of an example. Nice job. Reverse. Drive through. You got one more minute. And I know that the arms start to get fatigued. You can also just go into reverse lunges because the legs are a little bit larger of a muscle group and you probably have a little more steam left. So don't feel like you have to do the arms the entire time. You could even alternate, do a couple lunges and then hit another set. You will be getting an amazing, amazing shoulder pump from these two sets. And they are both moves you can repeat if you want to get a couple more sets in. Good. Keep going, team. You got about 15 more seconds left. Woo, shoulders on fire. <sighs> Perfect. Hi, Ravi. <sighs> All right, out to the side. <sighs> Last three, two, one. You made it. Go ahead and set those dumbbells back in. All right, you guys, just a couple stretches. And as I mentioned, this is just the bare minimum. I would love if you prioritize a little bit more stretching on your own or go grab a 10 or 20 minute option that I have for you already in our playlist. Take your hands behind your back. We're going to stretch our chest. Great work today. Now, it had been a minute since I did a boxing workout, so I thought it was time. If you like this, make sure you let me know. We can prioritize more in our schedule. All right, go ahead and hit a lateral lunge. Stretching out through that adductor. Good, turn to the side. Find a squareness in your hips so you're facing forward. Now come down and give me a nice rotation. Good work, your arms should feel a little shaky. All right, go ahead and switch. Lateral lunge on the other side. Great job. Turn, 
find that low lunge. You can be here. It's all up to your individual mobility. And then drop down to the hand. Rotate, face the back wall. Nice job. Perfect. Go ahead and bring that arm down. Gently walk center. Heel toe in just a tad and then roll up through your low back. Excuse me. Or squeezing your glutes as you come up. Good. Finishing a nice tuck and finishing with your hips and your abs tight. Roll your shoulders back. Beautiful job. Okay, we're going to finish with two of the biggest breaths you can find in through the nose and out through the mouth. I want you to put a smile on. Inhale, big lift. Exhale. Good. Reaching long through those fingers. Last big deep breath in, team. And exhale, big smile on, and bring those hands together. Fantastic work today. So excited to see a lot of you guys live. Those of you guys that popped in to say you're going to do it later, I hope you enjoyed it. And everybody else on the replay crew. I will see you guys next week, same time, same place, Tuesdays and Thursdays, 9 a.m. Pacific time. Until then, enjoy the rest of your day and just make it fun. All right. See you guys later.